Hi, it's Keith from Site2 Traffic Software. Just wanted to show you through our Site2 Traffic Software interface. Uh, it's a very powerful little uh, website builder and it builds websites very, very quickly. Of course, you need to log in. Uh, as soon as you've done that, you'll get to a page called Source Files and you'll be able to browse and have a look to see what, uh, what template you want to put in. If you go with template number one, there'll be a number of colours will come up for that standardised template. Uh, those colours only work with that template, but uh, the others, the other templates are different. Here, you've got uh, you browse to the folder you've got the articles in that you're going to use. You click on one article in the folder, and it will populate all of them. The output folder is the folder that you've created on, on the software and we show you how to do that in the training videos anyway. Uh, and that's where the website will end up, is in that folder. Site information is fairly clear, it's the site name, the description, the keywords, the primary keyword and of course the website name. Here you've got monetization for AdSense, Amazon, Clickbank and of course you pop in a Clickbank search term. You can also choose to wrap the articles around the um, AdSense and what that does is some people like to do that, others don't. So we just thought we'd create that option inside there for you. In here you've got the home page will either be a random article or the site map. We choose random article and uh, just feel that that gives us some, some leverage. The articles can be put in via article file name or article first line so you've got the option to choose just by a simple click of a button and if you wanted to add a blog at some point you can uh, you can pop that in as well banners horizontal and vertical you can put in these can be for CPA products uh, commission junction um, any one of those that uh, are out there it can be a Clickbank product it can be anything with that the banner will fit on the site and uh, you just need to pop the URL information whether it's on your um, on your computer or on a um, on a Clickbank. Down here you can uh, link to other sites. Over here you can include design articles on the site or not. If you include them you just go down and you select one of the ones that uh, you might be interested in clicking relevant to your site. Advanced features, we've got an auto highlight of the primary keyword, you can click yes or no. You've got snippets which uh, we like to do at 200. Uh, normally when you see it open it's a 3, but we like to change it and that's how simple it is. We also like to randomize our snippets, but you can just have standard snippets so they're pretty much the same all the way through. And down here you can inject links. Again, this is where you can pop in uh, CPA links inside the text. You can uh, do Clickbank. You can do. Uh, you can pretty much send people anywhere from these links as long as there's a URL. You can send them there. And of course, you put in a keyword phrase. Pop-up window you can put in, and it's just a matter of uh, putting the HTML here relevant to uh, an autoresponder. Uh, so you can collect uh, collect the names. Over here, you can also include a graphic, uh, which is a small graphic above the uh, above the menu on the right-hand side of the page, and it's a maximum of 160 pixels wide. Privacy page you can change, contact page you can change. Uh, you can add YouTube in one of three spots on the site, uh, on the page, uh, top, middle, or bottom and that will automatically pull a YouTube uh, video directly down and you can do it in, in either one of these two formats which are the standard formats. RSS is uh, auto submit. It automatically creates an RSS feed relevant to the site. You just pop in your login name and login password and you're good to go. FTP upload. You'd pop in www.mywebsite.com username and password. These would be from directly from your uh, your server or host. Uh, and if you wanted to put it in a specific folder, you could put the folder name here, and that might be just uh, F O L D E R. So uh, if you've got 
no folder being used uh, just putting on the root ignore that completely hit connect that will tell you what's happening here once it says you're connected you just hit upload and you're uh, you're done on top of that you can also go and uh, put Google Analytics information in you can put Google AdSense uh, custom channels code in and they're the ones that uh, if you wanted to sell the sites later on or you want to uh, flip them uh, they're good to have these other couple of things a visitor spy and Ed's tracker are both very good tools as well to use for that that process um, or you just might like the information uh, also we've got a, the ability to access a protection on your AdSense uh, some people have a habit of um, clicking your abs AdSense and possibly getting you banned so we've put a protection in place to uh, to prevent that from happening you can load a project you can save a project and it's a one-click site creation button once that information is in place very very simple and very very easy and I'll just show you a couple of quick sites uh, that we put together um, so you can have a look this is one we put together very quickly uh, online MBA so we're doing it with a computer and a brain it's not the prettiest site the, under the Sun but that's with the standard template that's number one and then we've got another site here that um, again is uh, another good site to look at so it's they're different they're the same they've come out of the same website builder and it's just a matter of what you want and what your preference is so that being said let's just um, leave this video for now and uh, hope you enjoy uh, what you've seen bye for now